The climate crisis is advancing while our population is growing. As the climate changes, crop yields are shrinking and farming is becoming less sustainable. Food, which has always been scarce in some parts of the world, is becoming harder to produce and more expensive. The poorest of the poor, those living near the poles and the equator, are being hit the hardest. To feed the world, we need a new approach to farming. Here we are in the world's first agrivoltaic agrotunnel. Inside this building, which is roughly a thousand square feet, we're actually doing the same amount of growing of 10 acres outside. What we're trying to do here is cut the energy piece out of the equation. We're growing crops outside underneath solar panels, and then we're using the power from the solar panels to power this tunnel where we have indoor vertical growing. So it's extremely efficient use of land. We're hardly using any water. What we've done is prove that it is technically possible to grow fruits and vegetables year round using a net zero energy building powered completely from the sun. So from a farmer's perspective, it's year round income and year round employment. It would work anywhere where humans currently occupy Earth. The next step is to show that this is economic. And that's what we're doing now. With support from the MacArthur Foundation, Western University aims to build new agrivoltaic agrotunnel clusters in different regions. Agrotunnels are highly scalable. Revenue will be reinvested into expansion, leveraging donor investment into an economically sustainable approach to feed the world. Instead of having food deserts, everybody can eat healthily, really no matter where they live on the planet.